This is Witchbase News for Friday the 4th of September 2020 I'm Commander Burr. In this weeks news ...there's some interesting wording on a frontier trading report to the stock market, Sagittarius I changes format and frequency and Canon Research launches the Canon Challenge. If you enjoy this video remember to hit the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and click the little bell icon to make sure you don't miss any of our future videos. Frontier Developments released a trading report to the stock market this week ahead of their full year results which are due this month. The report contains general positive news about the companies position all over but there is a small paragraph referencing Elite Dangerous and the incoming Odyssey expansion as well. The text does use some rather odd phrasing mentioning as it does that the expansion will bring quote familiar face to face personal scale to players unquote. We're guessing that what they're trying to reference in rather clunky terms there is first person action rather than ship to ship action between players and NPCs. The most interesting phrase to us however was when the text went on to claim that the expansion will quote ...increase cooperative opportunities within the game. There's no hint there as to how the game plans to implement those further cooperative opportunities but it is interesting in and of itself that Frontier considers it an important enough feature of Odyssey to go to the trouble of making specific mention of it in a stock market report. If we were to speculate based on what we do know already it's possible it may be alluding to the combined arms sphere of combat gameplay that Frontier have mentioned where ships, SRVs and FPS commanders will converge. Whatever it is pointing at it's clear that Frontier consider cooperative gameplay important to both the future of the game and Odyssey. Interesting times. The stalwart in universe print magazine Sagittarius I has been reporting and informing on the galaxy gameplay politics and tactics of Elite Dangerous since September of 2017. In the time since then whilst following the fortunes and favour of Elite Dangerous the formerly monthly magazine has evolved and adapted to its readership's demands launching a podcast version alongside the monthly journal. As the demands of the readership have ebbed and flowed however the magazine and podcast eventually became a quarterly affair. This month has seen the galaxy's flagship magazine evolve yet again dropping the undoubtedly huge production overheads for a print based production in a changing community. Instead this time settling as a shorter, tighter, purely audio podcast while simultaneously returning to its roots in a monthly release format. Personally whilst I was always a fan of the printed magazine I rarely had time in my schedule to give it the attention that it so richly deserved instead defaulting to listening to the podcast version and then only in hurriedly grabbed segments where time allowed. The now shorter hour long audio version still comes with the same high writing standards, professional production quality and Wotherspoon's fantastic hitchhikers guide like narration between segments but it is now, for my money at least, much more convenient to digest in the middle of a busy day and I'm pleased to say presented more regularly back on its monthly schedule. That has to be a win all round. And finally Canon Interstellar Research the galaxy's finest collection of mines has this week launched the Canon Challenge ...a galaxy spanning tour to end all tours that will, for the moment at least, take in all flavours of the sights, sounds, phenomena and life forms that the organisation has ever documented. If you wanted to see one of everything that Elite Dangerous has to offer in its scientific cupboard then this 500,000 light year round trip will serve it up for you if you bring the frameshift drive and have the internal fortitude to keep the space madness at bay. Should you choose to document the journey producing evidence of your grand tour to Canon there could even be a prize in it for you. You'll find a link in the description below to the tour on Canon's website alongside links to everything else we've talked about this week. That's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then ….o7 CMDRs follow the greens on the way out and do keep clear of the toast rack. We very much look forward to seeing you next time. <laughs>